I'm at French Prairie Perennials in Aurora with Carrie. And Carrie, you know, we come and we speak with your husband Rick about plants. Mm -hmm. But, you know, there's other things to gardens besides plants. There's accessories. Right. So what do you think about wind chimes? You really have a great selection here. Well, thank you. I think we do. Um, I personally like soft wind chimes. I find uh, really loud ones kind of annoying. <laughs> but um, I think not only should you have something for sound, but also for movement in the garden. Um, I think that uh, while plants are lovely, mm -hmm. it's always nice to have a little bling, a little bit of something with texture, a little bit of motion um, to keep it interest. And I like this one because it's that ceramic sound. It's different than a jingling bell. Mm -hmm. So really something for everyone. And I think, I know it must drive you guys crazy when people have to go and shake them all, but really you want something that fits your personality in your garden. Absolutely. That's important to us that everybody feels like they have something unique and that suits them. Ah, that is nice. Well, you have so many things in this gift shop, but let's go <laughs> over and talk about rain chains. All right, sounds good. Carrie, you really have a nice selection of rain chains. It's something maybe people don't uh, think about, you know, adding to their house or for um, something pretty. And this one even has bells. So that's kind of unique. Yeah, I think it's really important, like I said before, to have unusual elements in the garden. Um, not everybody has maybe a large yard, but can certainly enjoy a patio or deck decoration. Yeah, that is nice. And this one, the, the cups is kind of more traditional, and then the bells is a little bit different, but I really like this one because it's like movable sculpture. Yeah, this is our number one seller. Very and um, this one not only does the water cause it to spin, as obviously um, it's going downhill from the gutter, but it just has a lot of visual appeal. It has a lot of modern look to it, and, and people enjoy that. It does. And so maybe you can give us a little bit of a tips on how to install it, because I'm thinking I need to hire somebody, but maybe not. No, they're quite easy. Um, you do have to um, disconnect the downspout mm -hmm. and you would insert this piece, thank you, uh -huh. into the oh, actual downspout easy. and connect it to that piece up there. And then once it's connected, there's an, another piece just like this at the base that you can uh -huh. connect to a basin like this. Some people just connect it onto the basin um, so that it doesn't blow in the wind. And then okay. some people actually set the basin down into a decorative um, container and so that they hide that portion. Very nice, really. And that that's makes it so much easier because then you don't have to hire someone, which right. is lovely. Right. And then maybe we have maybe a more beach kind of theme or something yeah. more rustic, and you have some things made with um, driftwood. Those are beautiful. Yes, we do. Um, very popular is our beach decor right now. And um, sometimes we have ones that have shelves intermittent spread throughout. Um, but it's really lovely if you want to transform your space into having a more summery, yeah. beachy feel. Why not? Why yeah. not? And then you do need somewhere to sit down. Absolutely. <laughs> so you need to take a look at maybe some benches. Yeah, and really a nice assortment. And the one with the flag really getting ready for 4th of July would be great. Yeah. We have some other um, items that will be coming in also that can help decorate your exterior that has to do with the American flag. And why not celebrate the old, good old USA? Definitely, definitely. So you have to come out to the new store in Aurora and come out to French Prairie Perennials and see all the beautiful plants outside, but all the great gifts and garden accessories inside. Well, thanks so much. Thanks for coming.